I started off wanting to make a 1920s project because I've been really very interested in the Harlem Renaissance and how that was a time when African-American people came together and just innovated. It was the first time we had the resources, time, freedom, community um, to be able to create our own art and so you just had this explosion, not only in the arts, but also just economically. Um, and so I just love that. And when I delved into it, um, I just started to realize how many parallels that there were with present day, how, you know, people are Emmett Till all the way to Trayvon Martin and unfortunately beyond that. And so I said, wow, I really want to create kind of like a modern day freedom song project on the heels of that. This is a story that needs to be told now with a better time than now. For a generation to be reminded of the great resilience and faith and power that people have to endure whatever songs that they sang, it didn't matter what they were going through, the songs that they sang gave them hope. A lot of the tunes uh, on the project talk about, you know, specific experiences like tunes like Greenwood, even specific experiences for a person um, that is struggling with these things like music's going to meet me there and, and uh, but also the hope, uh, you know, that, uh, well, you know, truth and um, uh, justice Equality will prevail, like uh, you must believe in spring. Our ancestors were full of faith and full of hope. And in this day, when people are trying to cry out and say that there is no hope, in the songs that she sings and in her voice, we are, I'm reminded that, yes, regardless of what's going on, there's always hope. The spirits of African-American people, it just, it can't be broken, no matter the horrible history and also the injustices that continue today. We still make beautiful music. We have a strong culture and our hearts, you know, our hearts can be broken, but they get unbroken and we, we just continue to persevere. It's really a, a project that uh, speaks to people beyond the jazz community, uh, beyond the music community, but uh, speaks to people uh, looking for a little bit of um, perspective and, again, some hope.